Hello Lulas, welcome back to my channel guys. If you're new to this channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment below. Also guys, there is a channel membership and you can join that by only paying $1.99 a month. Um, also guys, don't forget, there's always the super thanks button. I uh, like to tell you guys that. But other than that, I am here to just show you guys Jaden. <laughs> I want this spot. I need this area to put another baby in, to take photos, to share, you know, in groups and stuff like that. And, you know, Instagram, I like taking pictures. But I cannot move him out of this position. Like, he just looks so cute. He's been this way since yesterday. Is that crazy or what? Like, I'm like, he's going to keep on this outfit for, like, so long. Because he looks so cute in it. Like, I'm going to have to buy him more of these colors, like, natural colors. He looks so cute. He's so sweet. Let me tell you something, guys. These, these dolls, these babies, whatever you want to call them. I call them babies. They don't call them dolls. But these babies will surprise you. Sometimes... It's the baby that you think you would be like, okay, or I'm not sure about, or whatever. It be the, those be the ones that really like grab you and get your attention and just really pull at your heartstrings. I cannot get over Jaden. Um, he has kind of set the bar pretty high, like for you know other babies in my collection. Like it's like if I get another full body baby, it would be like. They're going to have to, like, really work hard. Um, I will say Gigi actually stole my heart, too. However, I am going to sell Gigi, but I know I'm probably going to have that sculpt again in my collection. I just, that was my intent to sell her to begin with, so I'm trying to go ahead and get some of these babies gone, like I said I was going to do in the beginning. Um, but, yeah, Jaden, Jaden, he's like... Fun to dress. He's like the perfect size. He's not like super tiny newborn, um, which I do like super tiny newborn. In fact, that's my next baby. I want a baby that's very, very small newborn, like freshly out of the hospital newborn, like six, seven pounds newborn. Um, but for me, I love him because I can put him on a lot of different clothes and stuff like that. And I just love the way everything turned out with him. Except for I'm not done rooting his hair, so that is still questionable. I'm going to just zoom in a little bit more. Like, let me see. <laughs> Isn't he, like, so adorable? Look at those little feet. Oh, my gosh, guys. I just love him. I love him, love him, love him, love him. I am going to root him soon so I can finish him up. Um, he has his own little hair waiting for him so i just need to fin i need to finish the prototype and then i am once i finish the prototype rooting i think i said i was gonna root um Gigi, but i think i'm gonna root him and then um i'm i'm painting on some stuff as well but i stopped that to to root so all i'm doing right now is just rooting 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 the prototype i'm praying to god that i can finish the prototype by the end of the week like by sunday at the latest and then be able to provide pictures and all that stuff um i should be working on her box opening while i'm doing that i don't like do like prototypes back to back back to back so um i haven't really found a good flow of how to uh you know be pre preparing for like special box openings and stuff like that but um, I know she has to go home with, you know, some nice little things and trinkets and stuff like that. So, but I'm, I'm just wanting to share. This is another short video, just showing what he had on. The other thing also is that he has on Snoopy. Um, I did not know that Snoopy was not a part of Disney. <laughs> so I was all bold in my group yesterday on Facebook talking about happy Disney Monday and then I posted it on YouTube, talk about Happy Disney Monday. And it's like, 
I think hours and hours went by and I people probably was like, somebody gonna tell her. But then one of my friends inboxed me and was like, Well, I just wanted to know, just just and just FYI, um, Snoopy isn't Disney, baby. Um, Snoopy is a part of the peanut crew. I was like, Oh, <laughs> Okay, that's the debatable. Any cartoons is Disney for me. <laughs> no, no, but um, that was kind of funny. Well, it was to me. Uh, let me know if you laughed. No, just kidding. But seriously, um, so I just, I have a question for you guys. For you, when you have a baby, you have babies that's been in your collection for a long time, you get new babies and stuff, and say you haven't really interacted with them do when you do you when you do interact with them do it still be like oh this is the old baby or does it feel like you just got a new baby because for me when i'm really connected with a baby and i dress them in something i like it's like i feel like i just got that baby like you know and it's like it's my energy level just goes way up and it's like sometimes i have to tell myself like girl you acting like you just see him for the first time like or sometimes if they they lay in a certain way or like now, like he's in, I put him in this position to take his photo the other day and I just haven't moved him since. And it's just like, I feel like I got a new baby. So, um, I think this is also one of the things that I used to do. Like if a baby, I felt like I might've not been, you know, bonded with a baby for a while, I would change them in a different outfit. And sometimes what I would do is, like, say for instance, let's say y'all haven't really met, met Jelly Bean yet, but say for instance, if I dress Jelly Bean, she's the Missy by Natalie Blake. If I dress her up like a big girl most of the time, and then after a while I start, you know, getting bored with her, feeling some type of way, I would go and start change her wardrobe to like more baby stuff, sleeper stuff, you know, little like uh, onesies and stuff like that. And it would like renew my interest in them. And vice versa, um, if it was a baby that I dressed more baby, I dressed them more like a big girl or a big boy. And it would do something. Sometimes just changing them, styling their hair different makes you feel like you got a new baby. Because I think sometimes we miss that rush of the box opening. And you just want something new and fresh. And especially if you watch videos all day and everybody's getting new babies and you got this same old moldy crody little old baby from 1972. Picture it, Sicily, 1972. Jaden came in my life. No, for real. And you just be like, I want a new baby. You start getting baby fever. You know, like baby fever with the dolls is just as real as baby fever having real baby baby fever. You just like, I just really want a baby. There's times where I just want a baby and I bought babies that I know I didn't really need or necessarily love totally, but I just wanted a new baby. It was a good price. I grabbed it. Um, I've kind of slowed down from doing that. So I do everything. Another thing that puts me like in a good space, um, for me is reorganizing my nursery, which it hasn't been in its proper order in a while, but I promise you guys, I am going to get it back where it's, at, it's supposed to be. Well, my closet has been good. I worked on my closet and I kind of stopped. Um, but it's just that I got so much stuff in here and I need to donate a lot of stuff for whatever reason. I haven't been able to like gather stuff and I haven't had a baby to really donate for to. But I think my daughter told me there's a girl that needs baby clothes. So that'll be good because I don't like to I don't like to take my clothes to once upon a child anymore. Because I've taken my stuff there. They give you nickels and pennies for it. And then they charge everybody else like top dollar for it. And I'm just like, you want to give me what for what? No, ma'am. And so i I rather just give it away, you know, than them make money off of me. And i I rather just give it to someone that needs it. So um, that's what I'm going to do. I, um, but right now... I don't got made this video. I don't want to make this video too long, but I've gotten into like with Gabby clothes. I'm going through her stuff right now. And because her clothes, I buy her pretty high quality clothes and stuff. As far as like her jeans and stuff, I don't want to just the same thing. So 
I do have places, well, it's people that's going to come and get that stuff. So I'm going to do her stuff first. I'm working on her whole reorganization in her room and stuff before school starts. That's my project for next, all this, this week, the end of this week. And hopefully I finish it by the end of this week, actually, though. And then, um, then I can get in here and I'm going to just donate. I need to check. But yeah, I, I rather donate to like, you know, people I know or my kids know or stuff like that. So, um, that's also a way that I don't feel guilty about the money I spend on accessories and clothes for my dolls. Um, a lot of people come across our channels and be like, y'all spending all that money on dolls. Y'all could be doing for real children, blah, 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 blah. Go mind your business. Um... Nobody ain't knocking them cigarettes out your mouth that you smoking every day. You could be feeding a child instead of killing yourself with the cigarettes. But anyway, um, you know, it's, it's that type of energy. But it also, it does make me feel good as far as my money worth. I feel like I got my money's worth. Because these, my babies, sometimes they'll wear an outfit one time and that's it. And um, I just feel better if you just, you know, you recycle yourself. Even with my um, accessories, like the rockers and bouncers and stuff, after a while, it's like, okay, let me give this to this baby or that baby, and then it goes from there. So, anyway, I am going to go. Um, I'm trying to get at least seven to eight hours a day in with rooting, and so I'm going to go and do that, and then um, I've, I pretty much shut down myself. I don't even have to set a time but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed seeing Jaden. um i know i hadn't did no changing video or nothing like that but i will be back i have a lot of fun things that's coming up guys just be patient with me i promise you i promise you i'm working on that too so a lot of fun things i'm gonna um miss andy is coming back in town so that's gonna be good so whoop whoop we got some stuff coming, so hold tight for me, guys. Don't hang in. Don't give up on me yet. <laughs>